welcome everybody. We are at Universal Orlando Resorts and if you are potty training a child, if you have diverticulitis, irritable bowel syndrome, um, perhaps you just had surgery or you're going to be very, very pregnant during your universal trip. Or if you have pre-workout. <laughs> if you have pre-workout. <laughs> if you have a bladder infection. If you have anything that's going to need you to find a restroom quickly, this video is for you. We are going to take you around City Walk, Universal Studios, and Islands of Adventure, and you can follow along with us on the Universal app so that you know what it looks like on the app and then what to look for when you're here. I know this video doesn't apply to everybody, but um, it, it, could. It, it could, and it has applied to me several times. I have several things wrong with me. My human body just doesn't get it. it, it it's not together. I don't know. And I tend to work out a lot, and I also drink a lot of coffee, so... The coffee, yeah. If you drink a lot of coffee, yeah. <laughs> energy drinks <laughs> right um so this video may or may not be for you if it is grab your phone open your app go to the search bar click restroom click any restroom and it'll take you to the map and follow along let's get started all right so before you even get into city walk you're gonna go through security and there's actually a restroom and security right there behind the store and behind the Starbucks where you rent the wheelchairs. Um, we're not allowed to film in that area. It is a security area. But just know if you go towards all the wheelchairs and stroller rentals and in between the Starbucks, you're going to find a restroom in there. Literally right across from the stroller rental. Yeah. By the way, I'm Deidre. I'm Adaria. And we're Night Strikes. We do a lot of Universal and Disney videos, so... If you're new here, hit that subscribe, hit the follow, hit the bell, and uh, trek along with us. We like to have fun, a little sassy, a little, little, uh, little goofy, a little funny. Always find some fun, no matter and what. Very bad puns. So many dad jokes. <laughs> In City Walk, you're going to see Red Oven Pizza Bakery and the escalators to take you upstairs. There's a Cold Stone Creamery and guest services. And what you're going to do is you're going to go down this back hallway. This is Administration Health Services and the restrooms. And right down there on your left. As you're walking towards Universal Studios, right by Voodoo Donut, this area looks like it should be for um, team members, but there's a tiny sign right there that says restrooms. Go down this hallway, and this is the exit from the theater. There's also this really cool mural here with the donuts. Donuts? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, head towards the end of the hallway. And there's your restrooms. But okay, he's gotta go. <laughs> and City Walk, as you head towards upstairs, you've got the Legacy Store here. This is Big Fire. Antihito's is back there. Um, City Walk Hot Dog Hall of Fame. And right next to Antihito's on the left hand side is gonna be the Banos. It's now slid in between Antihito's and Universal's Great Movie Escape. Right over there is Fat Tuesday and then Pat O'Brien's. So if you're up top here, Banyo's here. They're hiding right behind this really cool Volkswagen. Okay, so those are the three public for everybody restrooms in City Walk. If you're at a sit down restaurant like Big Fire or um, Cowfish, Toothsome, Hard Rock, those places will have a restroom of their own. Mm -hmm. Just no, and it's themed. <laughs> the, yeah, the restrooms are themed. If you're just going into like a men cheese, no. <laughs> so I would suggest asking the host as soon as you get in there, hey, where are your restrooms located? Just so that you know if you're gonna go into a sit down restaurant. Yeah. Um, let's head over to Islands of Adventure. <laughs> what you're gonna wanna do when you come in is turn left. You see that thing over there that says waterworks? That's a cute little pun for, um, you know, like that's the toilets. Yeah, that, that's where the water works, where you can flush a toilet. There are family restrooms over to the right in health services. If you just need a general restroom, you're going to want to go off to the left. Let's go ahead and hang a right and we'll go towards Zeus Landing. Before you get to Seuss Landing, there's a really cool bar here called Backwater Bar. And there are restrooms right on the other side of Backwater Bar. Into Seuss Landing, you're going to 
you're gonna want to look for one of two places here, either Circus McGurkis or Moose Goose, Mo Moose Juice Goose Juice. I never say that word right. Okay, we found Circus McGurkis Cafe Stupendous. If you are near this yellow tent, restrooms are right around the corner here. We've got some construction right now. This isn't always here, but we are gonna follow the signs. There's an exit for Circus McGurkis. And there's the restrooms. If you're over here closer to the Mulberry Street store and Moose Juice Goose Juice, there's a restroom right around the corner from Moose Juice Goose Juice. This is also gonna be your closest restroom if you're exiting the Lost Continent into Seuss Landing. Just follow this little pathway over here. And there's the restrooms. These restrooms smell like cotton candy. And they're always clean. All right, we had to stop for pizza tots while we're in Seuss Landing. They're the best. Yes! yes. Look, at, look, look at this cheesy gooeyness. Oh, yeah. <laughs> also, shout out to Jonathan, who just ran into us and said hi. Thank you so much. We love it when you guys stop us and tell us hi and stuff. We love it so much. Yeah, yeah. Look, let us know that y'all join in with us and uh, yeah. don't mind our goofiness. And, no. Uh, and that we can help you plan your vacation a little better. <laughs> yeah. Um, hopefully, this bathroom video helps. Um, sorry, Jonathan, that you're, you're in the bathroom video, but we appreciate you. <laughs> For your benefit. For your benefit. <laughs> in the Lost Continent now. If you are going into Poseidon's Fury, make sure you use the bathroom first. The wall of water will get you every time. So in each restroom, there's also a sharps container. So if you're going to be needing to go administer a medication, that's another good reason to know where the restrooms are. All right, once you see the delicious kebab sign, make a right. And there will be a little shop here. And then the restrooms. They're kind of hidden back here. In the Wizarding World of Harry Potter Hogsmeade, there is only one restroom. And if you listen closely, you'll hear Moaning Myrtle. And she's like, <laughs> it's kind of embarrassing, but kind of cool. Hmm. Oh my gosh, it's always so packed in here, and there's almost always a line for the ladies. But in between Hogshead, across from the Owl Post, gonna be public conveniences. All right, there are two restrooms in Jurassic Park. Over here by Pizza Predatoria. If you turn to the right, you see a sign that says additional seating, which is over there, then over here, going to be restrooms. And these restrooms are intense. They have the Jurassic Park music that makes it feel like you're the lawyer in the restroom and getting ready to be eaten by a T-Rex. Very fun. If you're closer to River Adventure, you're going to go to the exit, head towards Jurassic Outfitters, and right across from Camp Jurassic and the Pterodon Fires. And these restrooms heading out of the way. All right, we're here in Toon Lagoon now. Go find the restrooms here. You'll definitely need them. This place is filled with water rides and water and splashes. All right, there's the entrance to Ripsaw Falls, Wasamata U store, and right over here are the restrooms. All right, over here by Wimpy's back in the Popeye area. We don't normally recommend these restrooms just because they're kind of tiny. It's humid, it's claustrophobic, and it's wet. The seats are wet because everybody coming off of Ludo's Build Rat Barge is gonna use these, and everything just kind of moist in there. So instead of calling it the restroom, it's called water closet. It really does feel like a water closet in there. It's tiny and jammed and okay. wet. <laughs> All right, I'm calling our restroom the water closet from now on. <laughs> our restroom we, is cleaner than that. We got a water closet now. Oh my God. <laughs> if you are near Comic Strip Cafe, or the store here. You're gonna wanna head kinda towards the exit. You're gonna notice this big building that's not really used for anything anymore except cheer competitions. And then all of these picnic tables. And here's your restrooms. If you are coming from Marvel Island and you missed your last chance to hit those restrooms, the restrooms that we just talked about are right behind this sign here in Toon Lagoon. You can see the sign. All right, coming into Marvel Superhero Island, right across from the ice cream, and directly next to the comics are the restrooms. 
right, we've got one more restroom here in Islands of Adventure. What you're gonna do is you're gonna walk past Cafe 4 towards the Hulk. Pass all the outdoor seating for Cafe 4. There's the entrance to the Hulk. Stormforce Accelotron. Lockers for the Hulk. And the restrooms. And that's the exit for Cafe 4. All right, we're gonna head over to Universal Studios, but we wanted to show you this restroom right here. If you are stuck in line at the entrance of Islands of Adventure, or if you're heading from Islands of Adventure to Universal Studios, there's these restrooms right here beside the Will Call kiosks and the ticket booths. I love all the different names they have for the restrooms. Water closets, loos. Nice. <laughs> we made it to the entrance of Universal Studios. But if you're waiting in line to get help with your ticket or to buy a ticket or to pick up a ticket, you're gonna wanna come over here to the right to the restrooms. Right around the side here. And there they are. These are probably gonna be the quietest restrooms in all of the land. If you're gonna find. Yeah. Unless it's like Halloween Horror Nights and we're backed up all the way to here. I'm gonna check it out. Okay, yeah, go, go make sure it's quiet. Yeah, if you're here on an early park entry, like a Thanksgiving or a Christmas day, and they've got you coming in this entrance over here also, and you're backed all the way up to the arches over there, these may not be quiet restrooms, but <laughs> most of the time, yes. So clean in there? So clean, smells so nice. So clean, it's a little smaller than the okay. other rest, uh, restrooms. Yeah. But, smells clean in there. All right, perfect. All right, let's head into Universal Studios. Hi. <laughs> Hi. All right, as soon as you come in the entrance, if you go left, there's restrooms over there by the lockers. But I feel like the closest ones, I don't know why, I just feel like these are a little closer to go over here. I'm gonna walk past guest services. Past the first aid. There's also some lockers on this side. And under these arches are the restrooms. If you're already in the parks, these restrooms are gonna be located by Hello Kitty, there is Born Stuntacular over there. The building is going to say Ciro's, and they're right under there. Oh yeah, Today Cafe is over here as well. So it's kind of nestled underneath this awning. All right, once you've come down the main drag, and you pass your fried rocket, before you hit Jimmy Fallon, there's restrooms right over here on the side. Right here underneath the big hoop the hoop restrooms. If you're in New York, buy The Mummy, The Arcade, Starbucks, Louis Restaurants. What you're going to want to do is take a left at Rosie's Irish Shop in between Rosie's and Louis. And there's some restrooms here off to the left. The Gotham Ice Company. Right across from Richter's Burger. Public restrooms right underneath these red umbrellas. All right, we're in London. Let's go down Diagon Alley. Come all the way down towards Green Gots. Take a left. Right underneath this umbrella are public conveniences, the restrooms. All right, but here's the Fountain of Fair Fortune where you can get some beer, and butter beer. And on the other side is Magical Menageries. Just look for the umbrella. It might have some rain coming from it after you do a spell. There it is. <laughs> right after you exit London and right across the bridge from Men in Black, this building with the brown shingles, these are your restrooms. Women's is on this side, men is on the other side. All right, right in between the Men in Black gear shop and the Coca-Cola store. That way is gonna be Simpsons. Restrooms. Honestly, these are super air conditioned and they're hardly ever busy because they're so well hidden back here. It's a good choice. Honestly, Simpsons Land is kind of a dead zone for restrooms. I, so you've got the ones over there by Men in Black we just showed you, or we'll show you the ones over here at the end of Simpsons Land. Right across from Bumblebee Man Tacos and the Lard Lat Donut Guy, gonna be the restrooms. This is also right next to the entrance, which is the big cafeteria here in Simpsons Land. And the, I know I hear that beat too. <laughs> and this is also the Animal Actors on Location building, so this is gonna be your closest restroom for that as well. All right, so we were just by the exit of Animal Actors. This is the entrance of Animal Actors. And 
There's SpongeBob SquarePants, and there's your restrooms right there. In between <laughs> SpongeBob SquarePants and ET. Way back here in Kid Zone, you've got the Five Goes West Waterland, the Curious George Waterland. There's restrooms back here at DreamWorks Destination. I will warn you, these restrooms are going to be full of wet children. Um, but listen, if this is your only choice. They're back here. So this is the entrance to the DreamWorks dance party. And then right over here are the restrooms. And if you take this little pathway here, it's going to take you over to the Curious George Playland. All right, here in Hollywood, you've got the horror makeup show, Cafe La Bamba. And if you turn this way towards Mel's Drive-In, you'll have some restrooms right in between Mel's and Transformers. There is the back exit of the gift shop from Transformers. There's where you can meet a Transformer over there. And then here are the restrooms right next to Mel's Drive-In. All right, we've got one more restroom to show you. The one that's at the front that was on the left that's more towards the exit. And that's not all of the restrooms though. Uh, there are restrooms inside of like um, the Burger Digs over in Jurassic Park. I don't think there's any uh, restaurants here that has a restroom inside of, other than like Lombards. Lombards, but like that's a sit down restaurant. Yeah, there you go. Um, so there are some restrooms and some quick services. I would honestly just ask a cashier when you get in there just to be safe. Mm -hmm. But the last restroom we're going to show you is the last, what they would call like a public restroom location. So, but that doesn't mean that those are all the restrooms. Yeah. All right, right before you exit, there are restrooms and then lockers over there. And that's your last chance to use the restroom before you exit the park. All right, that has been your tour around City Walk, Islands of Adventure, Universal Studios, where all the bathrooms are. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you're going to a restaurant, double check with the host or the cashier there to see if there's a restroom inside also. We just did what they would call like public restrooms, the ones that are on the Universal app map. Yes, uh, so. if you just need to get there quickly. Right, <laughs> and that way you can be prepared. I know that doing this really helped me my first time at Universal before I knew where they were all at. Hopefully it helps you. Yes, if you're a little embarrassed because you think that People's gonna notice, or you're afraid of a smell. Poopery. If you never heard of it, it, it does wonders. Get some poopery. Yes, we took it on a cruise. It was amazing. Amazing. All of the restrooms I showed you have a baby changing station in the women's, at least. I don't, I don't know, in the men's. Uh, yes, yes, they do have one as well. Okay. All right. I was like, I've never been in the men's restroom. I don't know. Uh, for the most part, uh, all the ones I've been into, I think, had changing. Stations. Okay. Yeah. Um, and if you need a family restroom on the app, if there's just you know the the icon with the dress and the icon with the legs that's just a two restroom it's the one with the kid in the middle that's going to be your family restroom mm -hmm. there's a sharps container in each and every single bathroom so if you need to administer medicine there's going to be that container there for you as well yes uh, if you want to get some poopery the little travel size one before you go we'll link it down below we get commission from that so oh yeah, yeah we're amazon partners <laughs> uh, if you want to use our link to shop for amazon we get like a penny here and a penny there <laughs> Yes, so we get something from <laughs> So if you end up liking this video, you think it was useful for you, uh, some good tips, and you thought we were a little bit funny, go ahead and hit that like button, that subscribe button, hit that bell for notifications, and um, consider joining our Facebook community, with, yeah. uh, Instagram community. And um, if you want to support us even more, we have a channel membership page on YouTube. Yeah. So, Thank uh, you to all of our members right now. We appreciate you so much. And thank you for trekking with us. And we'll see you real soon. Yeah. Bye. Bye.